the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you. People do things. That's how we can discredit this. So that's what you saw here. I, I just thought it interesting, this fact that the first thing that come out of your mind is that this man is not a god. I mean, what? And then, then, look, keep reading and you'll see what the blind man is going to say. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. Where are we at? 17? It says, yeah, it's set, but then it's set, one says it's not a god, you keep another son, but others. Oh, yeah. Others. Where am I at? Now, let's say this verse 16. How yeah. can a man that is a sinner do such miracles? And there was a division among them. Because so, some, some, some <laughs> actually <laughs> recognized. Their eyes were open <laughs> and they understood. You can't it? do this. <laughs> Not everybody can do this. I, I just can't imagine a sinner doing this. Come on now. <laughs> you know, and why would he? There ain't no exactly. money in it. <laughs> ain't no money in it. There's no, there's no what? There's nothing in it. There's him. nothing in it. So he wouldn't do it, right? He couldn't charge nobody. But you're right. That's that's I'm, that's interesting. Some people's eyes were open. Yeah. And they was like, wait a minute now. You said this man is not a god. How you gonna tell us? How, you know, you can back that conversation at the table, can't you? You be like, wait a minute. When you said the man is not a god, <laughs> what what is it? Yeah. And it should have been like this. Yeah. This is this is this is a natural order of things because you have those who try who are trying to maintain power. Mm. And you have those who actually not don't have a hidden agenda. They're just experiencing what happened. Yeah. And yeah. so the those who are trying to maintain power are trying to find fault. And so they just come out, well, this man can't can't do this. He's a sinner. And they're yeah. like, wait a minute now. I ain't never that. seen no sinner do nothing. Like Come on, Lila. Exactly. And I do like the fact that the blind man, before he gets into it, is he gonna do it better as we go further. But he just yeah. said, "I, I watch, and and I can see. I can see. I, I mean, that's it was just so simple for him. <laughs> yeah. They say yeah. unto the blind man again, "What sayest thou of him that he hath opened thine eye?" He said, "He is a prophet." He said, "Look." He said, he said the opposite of what the other guy said. You just told me he is not a man of God. Yeah. I'm telling you, based on what he did to me, well, that's a prophet. Yeah. And that means a man of God, don't it? Yeah. That, that's exactly what that means. I'm telling you, opposite of what you perceive him to be, he is a prophet. Go ahead. But the Jews did not believe concerning him. What, why? He had been blind and received his sight. Oh, he must be. So they called the parents of him. Uh -huh. and had received his sight. <laughs> wow. We we gonna have to we're gonna do everything we can to dispel this. We're gonna turn every rock over. Because <laughs> we see power and authority leaving us. Us. <laughs> yeah. And going we did. to whoever did this. Exactly. We're gonna challenge this. Yeah, this and probably did. was trying to figure out how they could do it, how they could I get think, a hold of them. Well they know they didn't. But Jesus did one time, remember when Jesus was talking about the uh they were talking about he cast out demons in the name of the other yeah. And Jesus said, well, go, go talk to the people that that you have that cast yeah. out demons. So let them tell you. Yeah. Tell you who who who, who is who. <laughs> Whose power is being used to cast out demons. And you know, the other bulb that they use it. But that's it. I'm just saying this as people, as we go into the story, look at the dynamics of, of how people uh, attack when things are done of God by the people of God, by the children of God. You know when you talk and I'll give an example again to when people sit there and say the the Bible written uh and we said all scripture are inspired right and by God and and they'll say it's written by men. You, 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 I don't know if you heard that before. Yeah. Uh, all these scriptures that were man. inspired by God to write. Mm -hmm. But so what they'll do is cut out the God part and say, no, they, Brother Addison wrote the Bible. 
I've like seen some saying that there's a few selected people wrong. If Kai, Kai speaks, then obviously they can hear. Mm -hmm. Right. Come on now. Yeah. And, uh, and the thing that really steals it for me is that each person that wrote, wrote from their experience. Their experience, their point of view, their yeah, angle, that's so their gospel like, 42. It's not like a group of people got together. Come on now. And came up with this story because it would all be exactly the same. Exactly. It would have no human experience in it. In it at all. Tying in uh, dates, not dates, but actually events and locations. Yeah. Uh, the other thing, too, is that the people want to just the way they want to ward it down is by putting it at the human level, putting it at the cardinal level. What, what do they call that? They, they, instead of looking at it in forms of spiritual information, uh -huh. they want to examine it through philosophy. It, yes. And that is where they fall short. Yeah. You cannot well, use human understanding and reasoning yeah, yeah. to understand something that doesn't apply Come on. to our understanding and reasoning because it is boring. Yes. It is from another place. Mm -hmm. It is outside of time. It is built and established upon different uh, uh, principles yeah different principles that's a good that's a better different yeah. principles yeah because uh obviously gravity has no place there yeah uh, uh at all yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know uh uh time has mm -hmm. no place there right um travel is completely different mm -hmm. there the 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 knowledge is so far and above because no man knows no, no. except for those who are given. Come on now. So and you know, everything about the kingdom is foreign to those who aren't from there. No, exactly. Who haven't been adopted to be there, who haven't been reconciled mm -hmm. and, and hasn't been reborn you know that's the, the the crazy thing is if you're you're if you're from let's say japan and your your parents are from there but they come to the u.s and have a child in the u.s mm -hmm. that child still has to be has to go through some things to be a part of Japan. Exactly. Just because it's the parents were born in the US doesn't mm -hmm. automatically make that child a Japanese citizen right. without something being established. Exactly. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I do. Yeah. So likewise, we're born in another place. So something has to be established to connect us to the kingdom. I think, and, I, and I agree, and one of the things too, that I want to throw people is that the, uh, I don't know if you have been confronted sometimes, some will be talking about the author, who's the author of the, of the different books in the, in the Bible, especially in the New Testament, and, and how many years and so before it was actually published as a document, and not understanding that Peter, Peter didn't write it. But Peter had, they had these scribes, see, his people. And then on top of that, they had oral traditions. A lot of stuff was verbally stated, restated over and over again until you got somebody who knows how to write, who knows how to put it. Because I guarantee you, Peter didn't do it. Uh -huh. and, Luke, and not only that, after, after it was written and they examined it, they probably said, no, that's not what I, that I was given. You oh, yeah. put it this way. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure that the 
the everybody who was listening, right? Everybody, yeah. those people that was passing on, because they were preaching it. They were preaching what was said. They they they've been taught it. They were they, they, yeah. somebody got the letter from Paul, and they they restated it over and over again until somebody said, "Let's we call it published it." And that's when you got the canons, right? That's that's how this this is that's the process how it works. It starts off as oral. That's what that's when Yeshua came. He taught orally. He didn't write a book. Yeah, he didn't. Right? Write down. Come on. He didn't establish a. He was a carpenter. He wasn't a news person. No, <laughs> man. And that's what they call scribes, people. That's what a scribe is. Yeah, that's what we document. Born a scribe. <laughs> not not. Any. Actually, he 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 was born the he, he was born a scribe because he wrote on the hearts. Oh come on, that what scripture said too, didn't it? Yes. I, you, God told you that one, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it? A lot of stuff. A lot of the people, because in my fact, cause it goes with the soul, right? He said the soul so is the word, yeah. and immediately Satan comes to try to take the word yeah. from not from their hands. Not from the manuscript, from but from the heart. And if you get the word in your heart, why he do that? Because if it gets into their heart, you know what? They can restate it too. Yeah. You know, and the biggest problem I think even today's time is that people don't read the scriptures. And the man is not, the man of God is, is not put him down because he's not. He is not reading the scriptures verbatim. He's not reading them from from chapter to chapter and from verse to verse. He's 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 putting commentation and commentaries into his message. He's trying to deliver it. So and and, it, and, and, and it has to be so because he is in this day and age. He would have no purpose if yeah. they were only taking the word and mm -hmm. just reading. Mm -hmm. Everybody can do that now. Matter yeah. of fact, even to the point to where you can have a AI, or mm -hmm. you know, not even AI, you could just have a computer mm -hmm. read it for you. Yeah. There's things that could read it for you. So you really don't need someone. You don't need to go to a, 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 a church and have somebody only, only, only read the yeah. word, and then you guys go on about your own way. Mm -hmm. The thing is, that position is established to perfect yes, sir. the saints. Yes, sir. To understand to the gospel. Come on. To understand the the the. the They, who they are mm -hmm. and yeah. what the gospel has established in them so yeah. that all they can do all they need to do is just take that yeah. it's, it's, it is it is it is a simple thing to do but because the enemy is so adamant yes about preventing that yeah it seems hard it, it, it does. There's a barrier there that seems like it's just tough to do. Like yeah. you, it, it's almost like it just sucks the words out of your mouth. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, all you have to do is explain, he came, mm -hmm. he anointed my eyes, <laughs> I washed, Woo and I see. Come it on, is bro. so simple. The simplicity of the gospel. I noticed, you know, I, I felt that the, the presence of God or mm -hmm. somebody told me the Come gospel. On. Come on. I heard, I believe, Woo. I'm saved. Come on. And that is the gospel that That's we the gospel. preach. I heard uh -huh. this. I'm you. telling you that this is the truth. Come on. I'm letting you know that I am changed, I am free. Come on and now. This is the same thing that is available unto you. Woo. Mm -hmm. And that's that is the gospel. That is the gospel. And this was this case, Brother Addison, somebody don't understand. Let me tell you something. The scripture said in Revelation, and they overcame him by the blood of by the Lamb and by the word of the testimony. Yes. 
So don't sit there and think that you're supposed to be able to quote scripture. I know that's something you get mad anyway. You don't, want, you don't have to quote scripture very bad. You need to give them understanding of the scriptures, and then you can refer to where they came from. Yeah. Uh, later on, but you you can you, you just tell that story. I would tell you that when I first when I first got into going to church, uh, I didn't I, you know I I didn't read the Bible. I didn't know the Bible. So a lot of things when that guy was saying when they was talking, or even when people was quoting in the scriptures, mm -hmm. I didn't know. I didn't know. I thought it was the person's words. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about you. I really thought what somebody was saying. You know. Uh, even the scripture, I was once blind, but now I can see. You know, I mean, man, look at that man. He was blind, man. He, I'm thinking about him. I thought that's what he was talking about himself. <laughs> he, he's quoting the scripture from the Bible. You know? Uh, so we that's the whole part of being able to open our eyes and be able to, and even Christ did it by parable. Those parables were meant to explain heavenly principles. Yeah. And that's what all he wanted us to do as well. But the point we're showing here is that people go up and, and try to find any kind of way to put doubt into God's Word. And it continues today that people are trying to put doubt into God's Word. Yeah. Read the yeah. Word for yourself. And, 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 and it's, just, it's not the only way that Satan has try to steal, kill, and destroy what God has placed in the hearts of man. Mm -hmm. You also have a, a mentality that has grown into the different bodies, uh, uh, basically churches, yeah. where they are not trying to share the gospel no they are trying to keep the masses so there is an entertainment yes portion that has entered in yes. there is a a emotional mm -hmm. tie that has come in so if we can't if we can't grab your five senses then we're gonna lose you and so that is the problem yeah. because it is not the five senses that god is trying to get you to understand yes. or to get you to move into getting an understanding Come it on. is your spirit yes it is your Art. understanding yeah. of spiritual things yeah. that gets you in position to where you come back to where you want to know more about who you are. Mm. And the more you know about who you are, mm. the more you want to know, the Come more on. you want to grab, the more authority and power you want to walk in it, the more you see this lost world as it is, and mm. the heart that reaches out to these folks that are dying Come on. in a sinful position, knowing where the results of eternity is for them, pulls and tugs at your heart to share the gospel yes sir that is poured into your heart full of untapped and, 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 and endless love do this and yeah. so it, 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 there is no entertainment needed in that yeah. it is exposure yeah. to Adonai to Yeshua HaMashiach, mm. to the true living creator of all, mm. to your king. Come on. And when you understand that, that need to, to, to move into that, to step out into the deep. Come on. Is, is there. And so to, to, to deal with this world and this world system becomes so much easier because your eyes can see the deceit. Ooh. Your eyes are open to see the attacks coming and mm. you have on the full armor of God. Come on now, come up. Yeah, yeah. To move forward in this world. 
and then there is no fear come on there is no hopelessness there is no despair mm. Mm. there's only the glory that has been revealed come on <laughs> and the expression of the true god exposed to this world has to draw people in exactly there is no way mm. that it can fail and you know it's funny to, to add up to that maybe thought about what you just said if it's drawing people in by you living you testimony your the changes that happen in your life draws people and I was using an example of when, when people was in the arena, <laughs> when they were burning them, when yes. they were feeding them to the lion, and they were sitting there singing and praising God until and volunteering. They were, come on, now. volunteering. Mm, mm, mm. When you know, mm. when you mm. know, what will your help come? Come on now. When come you on. know that this is not it. That this this is this is a a this is like a holding cell. Come on, bro. Matter of fact, matter of fact, it it's it, it teaches you a, a point that I like, and you I know you agree in that sense that you don't use it as as often as people may think you use it. I'm not sure how often you use it, but when God told you when you had that heart issue, uh -huh. and and the man was we're talking about you leaving this world <laughs> and God gave you I didn't promise you 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 feared about something <laughs> you worried about something that wasn't promised to you that was not word. my word that was that man's word come on my word is tomorrow's not promised it's not promised why are you worried about it why are you and stressed? out of all the things that God could have placed on my heart he put that there. Something yes, that sir. I was worried about. He said, you shouldn't worry about this. It may not exist for you anyway. <laughs> Why worry about it? I don't worry, you stressing and like you said, stressing and fighting for tomorrow. Yeah. And, he was and like, it isn't even there. there. It, it, it hasn't even there. showed up yet. Mm -mm. It has not arrived. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so stop stressing. You can't do nothing about it anyway. To get out of the way. Yeah. And once you got out of the way, God had his way. Yes. I Come mean, on, bro. He so gave you the peace as a pastor all the understand. We oh, just use that brother. That was, that was brother Asin's testimony. But it's, it's, it's a lot of people out there. When we actually cast our cares, cast our concerns, and give it to God, and try to not try to fight the battle. Some battles are not meant for you to fight in the first place. It's God to boast it. God will fight those battles for you, but you got to get out of the way. Yeah. You know? Well, so I, I like that. Huh? You have to be exposed yeah. to God. Yeah. Because without that, despair mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. will cause you to take the very life that you have. Come on. And when you, you look at this up. life, <laughs> you give up. Yeah. There's no hope. <laughs> and what are so you fighting there, for? There, there's more people. This is statistics, so you know I can't I can't confirm these t statistics. But they're saying there's more people killing themselves now than ever before. Yeah, look, some are taking other people up. You know, <laughs> and, and and all you have to do is just look at the attacks on this life. Yes, sir. Look at the desire to believe the a lie, which is to believe Satan. Yeah. The father of lies. Yeah. They rather believe Satan over the truth, which is Yeshua. Yeah. Yeah. So they're they're choosing. They're making their choice, and it is so obvious. And it's so Be matter of fact, believe a lie <laughs> over the truth. And look, look, and look, I hate to break politics in again, but that's a good example, right? You, the, how many accepted the, the, uh, like the Hollywood tapes, the, uh, I'm talking with this, this one particular candidate, the, 
the, the numerous lies, the, the look, somebody's got them up on trial for rape. I mean, literally rape. Uh, but it's a civil suit because of the statute of limitation. And, and there's people who still, even though we're talking about the January 6th thing, yeah. even though we're talking about the Georgia thing, talking about the false electorates, uh, you, you see what I'm saying? And yet yeah. you still, you still is knowing, you, you know they know, right? It, hey, it? This is what dropped in my heart. What? Give us Barabbas. Yeah. <laughs> Give us Barabbas. Yeah. It's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> and, 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 and then the joker down in Florida trying to see how I can be a Trump without Trump. And, and it's like, really? And then they break, and make him look stupid because now he's fighting Mickey Mouse. Yeah, but you know, they said that they're coming here to, to Atlanta now. They can come to, they can move if they... No, they're saying that they're, that, that my wife was reading some yesterday. Uh-huh. That Disney is, is so, in the process of moving, Disney World is in the process of moving to Georgia. Mm. Yeah, so they put some cars on the table. North Atlanta. And I mean, it's going to take a big chunk of resources mm -hmm. because you think about all the employees all the finances that come through just for that. Yeah. And and if they, all if they, because of somebody's policy exactly. that was based upon uh, uh, fear-mongering. They, they went after woke. He said yeah. woke dies here. Yeah. So so, so you sat there and talked so about the truth, game. Truth, truth dies here. That's what he's saying. Yeah. Because that's what yeah. woke means. Yeah. Understanding the truth. Yeah. Not seeing the truth. Yeah. Yeah. You That's do what my way to how way. You 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 filter past all the lies, all the all the junk, and now you have been woke. You're not sleeping yes. through existence. You're woke and you have an understanding mm -hmm. of the truth. Mm -hmm. So he's fighting against truth, which is fighting against Yeshua, mm -hmm. who is truth. Yeah. This is the day that the Lord has we shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Love you.